Hey, if you'd like to support the production of more Move University video tutorials, then please visit the support move section on moveuniversity.com. Thank you and enjoy. So these lipoproteins have obviously protein components to them. And some of the more important things to consider about these proteins is um, the, the fact that there are apoproteins or apolipoproteins, these specific proteins that are important in, in kind of realizing and helping, with, helping you understand what's going on with the functions of these lipoproteins. These proteins do specific things, and because they do specific things, that kind of helps you understand what's going on with the lipoproteins. So there are a bunch, and this is, this is definitely not all of them. These are some of the main ones. Um, but the ones that I'm going to be talking about specifically are highlighted in green. So let's get to it. Let's scroll down just a bit. All right. So apoprotein A1, made in the intestine and the liver, uh, its main lipoprotein partner is the HDL, and it, this is coming from, my, from chylomicrons. Uh, its important function is activating LCAT, which is leth lecithin cholesterol acyltransferase. What this does is it actually makes cholesterol esters. It makes cholesterol esters, which we saw in the previous video can be done by uh, ACAT, but uh, LCAT does it in a slightly different way that we'll see later when we actually talk about HDL particles. And it also forms a structure of HDL. Um, ApoB48, made in the intestine, is partnered up with chylomicrons. It's actually unique to chylomicrons. This is only ApoB48 is only found in chylomicrons. So that's an important thing to note. Um, and it's basically important in, in, in um, the assembly and secretion of chylomicrons from the small intestine in order for chylomicrons to do their function in delivering dietary um, lipids to the uh, in the body. Uh, ApoB100, made in the liver, is partnered up with VLDL, IDL, and LDL. Uh, it's important, of course, in making VLDL and secreting it. Um, it is a structural portion of all three of these, and that's actually an important thing to keep in mind as well. And one thing that's really, really key is that this ApoB100 binds the LDL receptor, so I'll put a couple stars by that. Actually, maybe three of them. That's really important. Um, because, well, you'll see later that this is this is a really, really important um, idea here. APOC2, which is a component of chylomicrons, VLDL, IDL, HDL, basically everything except the LDL, it's really important because it activates LPL, which is, I'm going to put three stars next to that, but that's super important. Um, LPL is lipoprotein lipase, which basically takes triglycerides and cleaves them into fatty acids plus glycerol. So that's something that we'll find to be super important. In fact, I'm going to put another star here by LCAT because that's pretty important as well. Um, APOE here, in the liver, uh, part of chylomicron rem remnants, VLDL, IDL, HDL. Uh, it's really important as a ligand for binding the LDL receptor as well as the APOE receptor. Right here, we were, I've written LDL receptor-related protein. That's also important, but uh, I don't think I'm going to talk about that very much uh, because I'm going to go over a general overview of these different lipoproteins. Um, and also, it's important in, in because it can bind these receptors. It's, it's important in uh, the clearance of, v, of chylomicron remnants as well as VLDL uh, remnants, which is basically the IDL. So this is important as well. So I want you to keep these in mind, especially these these ones in green uh, when we're talking about the lipoproteins, because it'll help you understand what's going on. Okay. So I hope that video was helpful as a brief introduction to these lipoproteins or to these apolipoproteins or apoproteins. And uh, hopefully, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and don't forget to share the video with anyone who you think might find it helpful. Thanks and happy studying.